Good day students. We have discussed unit 7 prose, poetry, grammar, all skills. Now we are going to see unit 7 supplementary reader, a dialogue. Glossary. First we are going to see, we are listening the glossary, then the character. Please listen. Listening is the basic of the language. Shall we? Ingenious, adjective, clever, original, and inventive. Mania, now an extensive, persistent desire and obsession. Malicious, adjective. Spiteful, intended to harm or upset some. Queer, adjective, strange or appalled, adjective, horrified, shock. Oddity, now the quality being strange or peculiar. Closet, now, Cabo. Incredible, adjective, impossible to believe. Contrived verb, cook up, hatch a plan by deliberate use of skills. Despotic, adjective, tyrannical, autocratic. Avarice, now extreme greed for wealth. Chest, now a joke. Very section, now a surgery conducted on a living organism for experimental purposes. And thus conclude the glossary. Next. Read the given lines carefully and identify the character, identify the speaker. First, the dialogue will be read and we find the answer. One, I suppose you think me queer. I will explain. Who said, Uncle Will? Don't come back. It won't hasten things. Said by Uncle Phil. Number three. He thought it's simply a cruel jest. Answer. Tom's father. He did not desire to do so. Answer. Professor Clinch. Five. He would think it's over. And come back later. Answer the collector. Then, based on your understanding of the story, answer the following. Previously, we have read the glossary and identified the character. Now, question answer. One. What did the uncle do as soon as he bought a store? What did the uncle do as soon as he bought a stove? Answer. He carried it in his pocket for a month, looked at it now and then, and then added to the collection in his safe. He carried it in his pocket for a month, looked at it now and then, and then added to the collection in his safe. He carried it in his pocket for a month, looked at it now and then, and then added to the collection in his safe. What did the uncle bequeath to the narrator? What did the uncle bequeath to the narrator? Answer. The uncle bequeathed an iron safe that contained precious gems and a dynamite that would explode when opened. The uncle Big wheat, an iron safe that contained precious gems and the dynamite that would explode when opened. 3. 
what was the condition laid by the uncle to inherit his property? What was the condition laid by the uncle to inherit his property? What was the condition laid by the uncle to inherit his property? Answer, the uncle asked Tom to open the box with relief and just to increase his expectation and desire. If he doubted and opened the dynamite would explode. The uncle asked Tom to open the box with relief and trust to increase his expectation and desire. If he doubted and opened the dynamite would explode. 4. Why do you think Tom happily looked forward to the expenditure for his uncle's funeral? Why do you think Tom happily looked forward to the expenditure for his uncle's funeral? Tom thought he would become a very rich man after his uncle died when he inherited the box of gems. Tom thought he would become a very rich man after his uncle died when he inherited the box of gems. Write a few words about the mechanism used in the iron box. Write a few words about the mechanism used in the iron box. Answer. The iron box contains an interesting mechanism. It will act with certainty as one unlocks it and explode 10 ounces of this improved super sensitive dynamite. One must open without doubting to desire for a fortune. If they doubt, the person will be blown to atoms. The box contains an interesting mechanism. It will act with certainty as one unlocks it and explore 10 ounces of this improved super sensitive dynamite. One must open without doubting to desire fortune. If they doubt, the person will be blown to atoms. The box contains an interesting mechanism. It will act with certainty as one unlocks it and explore 10 ounces of this improved super sensitive dynamite. One must open without doubting to desire fortune. If they doubt, the person will be blown to atoms. Next six. What was the counsel offered to the director? What was the counsel offered to the director? The counsel offered was to quit thinking about the box and its contents. The council offered was to quit thinking about the box and its contents. So, why and when was the narrator shot? Why and when was the narrator shot? The narrator was shocked when he opened the safe and found nothing but an iron box wondering whether it contained the gem or it was a lie. The narrator was shocked when he opened the safe and found nothing but iron box wondered whether it contained gems or it was a lie. So eight, what was the doctor's warning to talk? What was the doctor's warning to talk? The doctor warned him that he would lose his mind thinking about a lot about the rumors. The doctor warned him that he would lose his mind thinking a lot about the rumors. The doctor warned him that he would lose his mind thinking a lot about the rumors. The doctor warned him that he would lose his mind thinking a lot about the rumors. The doctor warned him that he would lose his mind thinking a lot about the rumors. 
Why did Tom dare to assign the task of unlocking the box to someone? Why did Tom dare to assign the task of unlocking the box to someone? Tom felt a stranger had no right to be subjected to the trial that he dared not face. So he did not want a stranger to open the box. Tom felt the stranger had no right to be subjected to the trial that he dared not face. So he did not want a stranger to open the box. Tom felt a stranger had no right to be subjected to the trial that he dared not face. So he did not want a stranger to open that box. And with that, we conclude the question answers. We need to recall. That's good for you. Starting with yourself. Ingenious, adjective, clever, original, and inventive. Mania, now an extensive, persistent desire and obsession. Malicious adjective is quite full, intended to form or upset someone. Queer adjective, strange or apparent adjective, horrified, shocked. Oddity, now the quality being strange or peculiar. Closet, now kaboom. Incredible, adjective, impossible to believe. Contrived verb, cook up, hatch a plan by deliberate use of skills. Despotic, adjective, tyrannical, autocratic. Average now, extreme grief for wealth. Just now, a joke. Vivisection now, a surgery conducted on a living organism for experimental purposes. Now, uh, second one, read the given lines carefully and identify the character, identify the speaker. One, I suppose you think me queer, I will explain. One, I suppose you think me queer, I will explain. Answer. Uncle Phil. Answer Uncle Phil. Number two. Don't come back. Don't come back. It won't have some things. Don't come back. It won't have some things. Answer Uncle Phil. Number three. He thought it simply a cruel jest. Three. He thought it simply a cruel jest. Answer. Tom's father. Answer. Tom's father. Four. He did not desire to do so. Four. He did not desire to do so. Answer. Professor Clinch. Answer. Professor Clinch. Five. He would think it over and come back later. Answer the collector. Five. He would think it over and come back later. Answer the collector. Now the recapitulation has been over. Now we are going to see the paragraph questions. See. Answer the questions given below in a paragraph of 150 words. First question. Describe briefly the contents of the letter written by Tom's uncle. One. Describe briefly the contents of the letter written by Tom's uncle. One. Describe briefly the contents of the letter written by Tom's uncle. Answer. Tom's uncle wrote 
that the box contained a large number of 5 billion blood rubies and a lot of diamonds. One blue diamond, hundreds of pearls, a famous green pearl and a necklace of blue pearls. Thinking of Susan, he insisted Tom to continue to have expectations and remember his dear uncle. Second passage, instead of leaving the stones to a charity, he gave it to Tom. The letter instructed Tom about the mechanism of unlocking it. It would explode 10 ounces of improved, super sensitive dynamite. If he opened it doubtfully, it would turn him to atoms. With faith, if he opened it carefully, he would nourish hopes and expectations. He asks Tom to be very careful. Once again, repeat paragraph 1. Describe briefly the contents of the letter written by Tom Anker. Answer. Tom's uncle wrote that the box contained a large number of five PGN blood rubies and a lot of diamonds. One blue diamond, hundreds of pearls, a famous green pearl and a necklace of blue pearls. Thinking of Susan, he insisted Tom to continue to have expectations and remember his dear uncle. Instead of leaving the stones to a charity, he gave it to Tom. The letter instructed Tom about the mechanism of unlocking it. It would explode 10 ounces of improved, super sensitive diamond. If he opened it doubtfully, it would turn him to atoms. With faith, if he opened it carefully, he would nourish hopes and expectations. He asks Tom to be very careful. We are going to read once again the third time. Now you can understand the paragraph very easily by continuously reading. Children. One, describe briefly the contents of the letter written by Tom's uncle. Answer, Tom's uncle wrote that the box contained a large number of fine PGM blood rubies and a lot of diamonds. One blue diamond, hundreds of pearls, a famous green pearl and a necklace of blue pearls. Thinking of Susan, he insisted Tom to continue to have expectations and remember his dear uncle. Instead of leaving the stores to a charity, he gave it to Tom. The letter instructed Tom about the mechanism of unlocking it. It would explore 10 ounces of improved, super sensitive dynamite. If he opened it doubtfully, it would turn him to autumns. With faith, if he opened it carefully, he would nourish hopes and expectations. He asks Tom to be very careful. Now, the first paragraph has been completed by reading. Second, explain the efforts taken by Tom to open the iron box. Did he succeed? Why? To explain the efforts taken by Tom to open the iron box, did he succeed? Why? Answer Tom went on thinking about it, finding people to advise, ransacked the libraries, imagined the wild plans, 
like throwing it from a far off place to open it. After the explosion, he could get the gems, but was sure he wouldn't succeed. He thinks very hard in vain for weeks and months. His father dismisses it that it is a dirty joke by his deceptive uncle. His doctor advises him to stop thinking about the iron box with precious gems as it would make him mad. He tries to put it in the bag but withdraws because he is afraid of the burglary. He consults Professor Clinch about his dilemma who dismissed it as an altogether incredible tale. Thus, Tom had to leave the box to the society for the preservation of human resection. First time it's been completed. Once again, number two, explain the efforts taken by Tom to open the iron box. Did he succeed? Why? Answer Tom went on thinking about it, finding people to advise, ransacked the library, imagined wild plans like throwing it from a far off place to open it. After the explosion, he could get the gems, but was sure he wouldn't succeed. He thinks very hard in vain for weeks and months. His father dismisses it that it is a dirty joke by his deceptive uncle. His doctor advises him to stop thinking about the iron box with precious gems as it would make him mad. He tries to put it in the bag but withdraws because he is afraid of the burglary. He consults Professor Clinch about his dilemma, who dismissed it as an altogether incredible tale, as Tom had to leave the bar of society for the preservation of human reception. We are going to read once again, third time. Explain the efforts taken by Tom to open the iron box. Did he succeed? Answer. Tom went on thinking about it, finding people to advise, ransack the life they produce. Imagine white plants by throwing it from a far off place to open it. After the explosion, he could get the gems but was sure he wouldn't succeed. He thinks very hard in vain for weeks and months. His father dismisses it that it is a dirty joke by his deceptive uncle. His doctor advises him to stop thinking about the iron box with precious gems as it would make him mad. He tries to put it in the bag but withdraws because he is afraid of the burglar. He counsels Professor Clinch about his dilemma who dismissed it. It has an altogether incredible tale. Thus, Tom had to leave the Boston Society for the preservation of human deception. We close two paragraphs writing and fill in the blanks with the right option and write down summary of a story at time. The narrator was sent for by his uncle when he was on his deathbed, on his travels, on in his workshop. Answer on his deathbed. Two, the uncle had collected precious jewels, stones, articles. Answer stones. 
free. His uncle announced Tom as his heir and wanted him to pay for his rented house or marriage funeral. Answer funeral. Fourth, leaving an iron box for Tom, his uncle instructed him not to the box through carry shape. Answer shape. Five, the letter read that the box contained a sensitive dynamite jewels money. Answer a sensitive dynamite. Six, he started thinking of all possible ways to open the box without being wounded, killed, my answer killed. Number seven, he planned to explore the box at the Asper job, the plan in favor of crossing the road. Home a safe distance away there. Answer a safe distance. Eight, his consultation with did not yield him any fruitful solution. Unhelpful Professor Fletch Susan. Answer Professor Fletch. Number nine. He failed in his attempts to open the box. His efforts to read the whole explosives led to Pope's confusion, suspension, and he had to change his dash, name and occupation, lodgings, appearance. Answer confusions, name and occupation. Then at last he bequeathed the box. His dash, his offspring, his friends, the society. Answer the society. My dear children, now we have come to the, the entire exercise of the supplemental reader, glossary, and identifying character, question answers, paragraphs, and fill in the blanks, and the summary. Why do we learn short stories? Why do we learn supplementary? To learn English in a very easy way to read the short stories. In other words, supplementary. We have already discussed what is that. If you listen to English, you can easily speak the English. If you can read the English, you can easily write the English. So, do children do read daily, every day, close, poetry, and supplementary. We have seven days, we have seven days. If you read seven days, each seven days, after a month or after a month, reading will be so easy. If reading will be so easy, writing will be very, very easy. Have a nice day. Thank you so much.